are some things you may not know about the movie Die Hard. Bruce Willis' most popular role at the time was in a TV show called Moonlighting. He had only done two other movies and they hadn't done very well. Still, he was able to secure $5 million for his role in the movie. When the trailer was initially shown in theaters, the audience laughed when they first saw Bruce Willis in the lead role, so the producers took him off the film's promotional poster. But after the movie started doing really well and word spread around, he was put back on. And the movie made $7 million in its opening weekend at the box office alone. When all was said and done, it would earn $140 million. Other famous actors offered the lead role include Clint Eastwood, Arnold Schwarzenegger, Burt Reynolds, Sylvester Stallone, and Richard Gere. The movie was filmed at the Fox Plaza on the Fox lot, and it was still partially under construction at the time. Some of the floors were not finished yet, and the movie contained different props that were already there. But other floors were finished and did contain offices of Fox executives. They definitely complained about the machine guns going off during the workday. The film is based on a book with a different title, but the producer only agreed to make the movie if they could call it Die Hard and the top of the building would explode. Joe Silver, who was the producer, asked John McTiernan several times to be the director, but he declined because he said he didn't want to make a movie about terrorists. Only 35 pages of the script was complete when they started shooting. Die Hard was nominated for four Academy Awards, but didn't win any. Originally, the helicopter scene was scheduled to be filmed over three days, but the city shortened it to two hours. Then, once they were out there, they shut them down after only 30 minutes. Alan Rickman filmed this scene himself. A stunt coordinator held him up by a rope 40 feet above an airbag. He didn't know when the coordinator would drop the rope, so the fear on his face when he falls is real. Die Hard is based on a book called Nothing Lasts Forever by Roderick Thorpe. And it's a sequel to the 1968 movie, The Detective, which starred Frank Sinatra.